NVIDIA has spent over five years studying input lag and responsiveness, which is how quickly a game displays the reaction to a player's inputs. A few milliseconds can be the difference between victory and defeat. Higher latency can hurt performance through missed hit registration, inconsistent aiming, and disadvantages when holding an angle. In 2020, we launched NVIDIA Reflex, which tightly synchronizes the CPU and the GPU to reduce latency by an average of 50% in top competitive titles. Today, we're announcing a breakthrough in our latency research with the introduction of Reflex 2 with Frame Warp. Over five years ago, our esports research team published a study illustrating how players aim better and complete tasks faster when rendered frames are updated based on more recent input. For example, when a player aims to the right, it takes some time for that action and the new camera perspective to be displayed. What if instead, an existing frame's camera could be shifted or warped to the right to show the results much sooner? Frame Warp reduces your camera latency through this concept, which has gone from research to reality. Let's dive into exactly how Frame Warp works. As a frame is being rendered by the GPU, the CPU is calculating the camera position of the next frame in the pipeline based on the latest mouse input. Frame Warp samples the new camera position from the CPU and warps the frame being rendered by the GPU to use this new camera position. The warp is conducted as late as possible, just before the rendered frame is sent to the display, ensuring the most recent mouse input is reflected on screen. In the end, players see the rendered frame, but with an updated camera perspective, reducing latency and improving your ability to aim, track, and hit more shots. Depending on the frame rate, this process can be happening hundreds of times per second, constantly delivering the freshest camera perspective. Gamers are going to feel truly connected to their mouse movements, whether it's tracking a moving target or quickly flicking to aim at an unexpected foe. To warp to the most recent camera position, Frame Warp shifts many of the game's pixels, which can create small holes in some regions of the image, especially when mouse movements are intense. However, NVIDIA has developed a latency-optimized predictive rendering algorithm which uses camera, color, and depth data from prior frames to in-paint these holes accurately. For example, here's the finals with Frame Warp and no in-painting. And here's what it looks like with in-painting. The result is a frame which shows the freshest camera position seamlessly inserted into the rendering pipeline. Using this cutting-edge warp process, Frame Warp reduces latency by around an entire frame time, which amounts to nearly another 50% of latency savings on top of Reflex Low Latency Mode, for a total reduction of 75% from native. Players will experience improved target acquisition, faster reaction times, and tighter aim precision. Let's see it in-game. In the finals, without Reflex, players can see a moderate amount of PC latency. Turning on Reflex Low Latency Mode reduces latency significantly. Activating Reflex Frame Warp reduces input lag by another 50% for a total reduction of 75% from native, making it easier to track targets in motion, land flick shots, secure eliminations, and the win. And unlike Reflex Low Latency Mode, Reflex Frame Warp provides significant latency savings even in CPU bottleneck scenarios. Here, we have Reflex 2 enabled in Valorant, a CPU-limited game that runs blazingly fast. Frame rates are not only insanely fast, but PC latency now reaches below 2 milliseconds. This is the lowest latency figure we've ever seen in an FPS. We're bringing Reflex 2 to top competitive games like Valorant and the Finals. With more to be announced in the future, Reflex Frame Warp is coming soon for all GeForce RTX gamers and will be available first on RTX 50 series GPUs.